location uh, because my room was kind of in a mess that you don't want to see it but I think I really like this light and stuff I'm also happy summer solstice I don't know today is also the first day of I never beyond did I mention that before? maybe I did and it was a DIY challenge chosen by Kelly's Books Bill I will probably put a link down to her maybe or something but this is this is what I did I mean you <laughs> footage you may have just seen that was what I did did a sharpie mug inspired by the felt and KOK bubble things if you can see yeah uh, so <clears throat> basically after I mean we run down you get a mug wipe it down with ice to make sure it's all clean free of oils or anything and you get your sharpies and just draw once you're happy with your design pop it in the oven <clears throat> and go how much I put it in <laughs> I'll, I'll convert it. So I baked it at 175 degrees Celsius for half an hour, which converts to 350 degrees Celsius Fahrenheit. 175 Celsius is 350 Fahrenheit, okay, for half an hour. So the, the glazing melts over it and sealing in the design. Uh, also, quick tip, uh, put it in the oven while it's cold and turn the oven on and don't take it out until it's completely cold because then you might, might, it might crack and you probably don't want that I mean unless you want your tea to come off <laughs> or something so yeah I had so much fun filming this uh, <laughs> now I take the footage or whatever it's like bad I am by no means a craft youtuber <laughs> I do like to craft but I never film it so yeah okay so I hope you really enjoyed this <laughs> Uh, I have a little bit of a reading update. I read some paper towns. Let me go check how much it was. Okay. I, um, where is it? 110 pages through. Okay, I think I'm making good time with this. I think I'm making a good time with this. So, yeah. Tell me how much. Are you excited? Are you participating? I, I would love to see your videos. Like, you know, link it or something. Just tell me. Or whatever. Uh, just. I mean, I already saw some of the hostess, and they were like, ah, so cool. And I just have to see if anyone else that I follow uploaded any new bibliothon DIYs. So, uh, I love you. Bye.